Hi, this is Russ McClay. How do you like that? Hi, it's pretty uh, boisterous. Yes, this is Russ McClay, and this is my avatar, Infrared Wind in Second Life. And we have been doing a series of episodes, and this is episode 10. Our last o episode was part two about how to change one's appearance, and I went from a hippie dude to this guy with shorter hair and shorter beard and <laughs> yeah and we showed in episode nine kind of the basics of how to do those things like changing your clothes and your avatars now my avatar in second life is really like version one or two so the the newer avatars which we'll probably meet in subsequent episodes are uh, becoming extremely sophisticated and uh, really amazing so the I thought the next this episode and the next and maybe the third one down we'll start looking at the interface the user interface in Second Life now I'm using s the uh, singularity viewer um, but there are several others that are third-party viewers but you can also use the official Second Life viewer and most of the functions that I'll be d showing here will be you'll you'll find in the official second life viewer i really like singularity because it it is a uh, kind of a preservation of the i think it was version two of second life that was really cool so but, but some of the functions obviously are the same and i'm going to go through the interface um <coughs> as part of this historical uh recording so let's just start there's so much it may be take more than, excuse me, having a little beer burping there. <laughs> now, there's probably so much here that uh, it's going to take, uh, you know, maybe three, four, five episodes. Well, if I keep to this rule of five minutes per episode, which I may have to extend because that is a very limiting factor. I'm already at two minutes pushing on three. So let's start in the beginning. Uh, we'll start at the top here at file. Very... Uh, common uh, Windows program initial entry in the upper left and so let's just start going through this stuff upload image L ten dollars now this is uh, if you want to upload a, an image to Second Life it's ten million dollars and we'll get into that later but I think I'm just guessing I haven't checked in years but I think something it's like 260 or so Linden's for one dollar so you can do the math uh, upload a sound is the same now why would you want to upload an image well the reason you would is if you are a developer you would want to be able to up you have to upload um, the textures for your um, you know your for your work for your pieces or it could be anything I mean you could have um, let's say you create uh, you know a ball in Second Life and you want it to have the the texture that looks like a basketball well then you can Second Life gives you the tools to build the ball but then you the texture you need to to import and, and so that's an upload and they'll charge you 10 for that which is like what is that I don't know it's fractions of a penny maybe um, the animations, upload animations, those are like for dances or like for you're going to sit up, sit down or stand up. And I think now I'm going to break my five minute rule. It's just too limiting. I'm going to go, <laughs> now the new rule is 10 minutes. <laughs> so I have a little bit more for this. Upload mesh, that's another, uh, the mesh uh, is 3D geometry. We'll get into that maybe someday. Bulk upload here you could you know you and how do you do the money thing well the way you do the money thing is somehow you have to get if you want to do these things you have to get money into Second Life somehow now one way might be that you um, do some kind of work in Second Life or you do something for somebody uh, whatever I mean that's a whole nother topic but there are ways to make money inside of Second Life uh, which translate into what they call Linden dollars. The other way, which is the way I do it, is you, you use a credit card and you can kind of just 
pump in a few dollars you know you can pump in ten dollars and then that gives you a whole lot of lindens to buy stuff with uh, the with second life i mean um, you, you don't have to buy anything i mean it's totally free the client's free you don't have to buy anything to to enjoy it and to explore and to you know to uh take part in second life but you know, in this, what I'm showing here, I'm just, I'm going to go through all these menu items, and maybe this will take <laughs> 10 episodes, uh, and now I've extended it to 10 minutes. And so, who knows? But I think it's important as a historical record of what, what Second Life is right now. 2016. Uh, import object XML, to be, to be honest with you, I'm not even sure what that is, but I do know what XML that's extended markup language and this is a way to define some shape so I don't know much about that import with textures again I don't know oh that's probably ex this object with textures textures are what you overlay on an object uh, set default permissions when you see a dot 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 in a menu it should open additional um, choices which in this did uh, I'll let you Explore that on your own. <laughs> Minimize all windows. Pretty uh, self-explanatory. And uh, take snapshot. Okay, this is very important because in, se in Second Life, when you want to save a, an image, you want to do that. So here's the, uh, in Windows, this is the uh, hotkey. Control, Shift, S. And uh, snapshot to disk. Which this is the one I use all always and it's control and that little back tick which is you know I don't know on most keyboards it's all the way to the left you have to go hunt for that one it's a special one and and quit control Q if you want to s just kill the program so that's pretty cool and pretty cool that we went through this whole menu and now let's go to the next one we're at seven minutes, so we may not get through all this, but you see the basic stuff that you would see in Windows, and I, I would assume in the Mac, it's, uh, they're, they're probably pretty similar equivalents. So you have um, search, we can click on that, see what we see, it's basic search window. Um, actually, this is kind of new. I <laughs> uh, yeah, oh, there we go, okay, it's a window. And we, we can get into that subsequent to this. But this is the search window, which has these tabs, and you can, which are filters. So under edit, let's go back to this. Search, select all. This is, um, well, it's not very something you want to do every day. But let's see what happens if we click it. OK, I, I don't know if it selects the view or what. Not sure what that does exactly. Attach an object. Um, that's also not very something I, I don't actually I don't use these very often so detach objects take off clothing these are things you're wearing gestures now this is definitely um, an important thing control G now gestures opens up this menu which is so much fun this is one of the the fun great things in in Second Life and uh, I hope I have uh, enough interest to um, to go through this but that is so awesome the gestures in Second Life are one of the funnest coolest things about it it's basically where you can make sounds and you can make your avatar do funny things and uh, just you know uh, I'll do one just as an example good day sir Okay, that one was an animation and a sound. Uh, a lot of fun stuff there. So let's continue here. We're at nine minutes. We're 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 coming up in the ten minutes, and I think that's a good length for these. That's a better length than five. Five's too rushed. Um, that's gestures. Control G. Profile. That's going to open up your profile menu. Let me just see that real quick. And a lot of stuff in there will get, <laughs> I mean, Second Life is so infinite. So that's, yeah, a quick way to get to that. Your appearance, which actually were the last, the previous two episodes. So we know what that's all about. And now I'm standing up. 
<laughs> and uh, make outfit which we'll leave it at that so that's uh, episode 10 there and we're going through the UI in the second life UI meaning user interface for those who like to know the acronyms and and probably knew them or forgot them but most of us we remember right until the next one which will continue going through the UI that you know this is episode 10 uh, adventures in second life with infrared wind great